Hi, I'm Valentina Pacella, and in this presentation, I'm going to walk you through the exploration of white matter disconnection in an Archicam case. Anarchican syndrome refers to involuntary movements of the controlisional limb, and different uh, symptoms patterns are associated with different uh, lesion locations. For instance, frontal lesions are associated with compulsive grasping, while posterior lesions are associated with levitation and non purposeful movements. Callosal lesions are associated with intermonial conflict, while the dexterity deficits. Um, is more typical of thalamic lesions. Anarchic hand is a very uh, rare syndrome, so the symptoms of the patient caught our attention, and we assessed a thorough neuropsychological uh, battery. The imaging revealed that the patient suffered from a stroke in the right hemisphere, uh, specifically in uh, more posterior structures, and this was in line with the anarchic hand symptoms displayed by the patient. However, she also manifested symptoms that were associated with frontal, subcortical, and callosal structures. So we hypothesized that other um, structures that were not directly involved in the lesion still contributed to the symptoms. So we performed a disconnection analysis via DTI, and the interhemispheric comparison of the tracks revealed that in the right hemisphere, there was the disconnection of the hand U-shaped tract. Um, the disconnection of frontoparietal uh, networks, the uh, disconnection of insular tracts and optic radiation, and the disconnection of frontooccipital and uh, occipital temporal uh, tracts. Furthermore, the um, reconstruction of the corpus callosum of the patient revealed um, the um, damage of the most more posterior section of the patient of the corpus callosum, as you can see in the left um, corpus callosum reconstruction. In conclusion, um, anarchic hand might be a disconnection syndrome, and uh, uh, the involvement of multiple networks will com contribute to uh, the symptoms displayed by the patients. I want to thank my co-authors and thank you for your attention.